You described the goals of a blockchain, you have a nice presentation on this, uh, as scalability, security, and uh, decentralization. And you challenged the blockchain trilemma that claims you can only have two of the three. So let's talk about each. <laughs> what is scalability in, in the context of blockchain and cryptocurrency? What does scalability mean? So remember, if we said that the blockchain is a ledger and each page receives a gets some transaction and everybody can write in this uh, in these uh, pages of a ledger nobody can be stopped for writing and everybody can read them okay scalability means how fast can you write just imagine that you can write an entry in this uh, special shared ledger once every hour well you know what are you going to do if you have you know, one transaction per hour uh, the world that doesn't go around so you need uh, uh, to have scalability means here that you can uh, somehow write a lot of, of transaction and then uh, you, you can read them and everybody can validate them and that is uh, the speed and and and, this, um, and the number of transactions um, uh, per second and the fact that they are shared so you want to have this uh, this uh, the speed not only in writing but in in sharing and uh, and uh, in inspection for validity this is scalability the world is big the world wants to interact, with, the people want to interact with each other, and uh, you better be prepared to have a ledger in which you can write lots and lots and lots of transactions in this special way very, very, very quickly. So maybe from a more mathematical perspective, or can we say something about how much scalability is needed for a world that is big? <laughs> <laughs> well, it really depends how many transactions um, uh, you want, but remember, that and um, I, I think and um, I'm uh, right now yet to go into uh, at least a thousands of transactions uh, um, uh, per second. Even if you look at and you know, um, um, credit cards, right? And you know, we are going to go from uh, an average of sixteen hundred to peaks of uh, uh, twenty thousand, uh, forty thousand, uh, something like this. But uh, but remember. It's not only a question of uh, of a transaction per se, but the value is that the transaction is actually being shared and visible to everybody, and the certainty that that is the case. I can uh, print on, on my own printer uh, way more transactions, but nobody has the time to see or to inspect. That doesn't count, right? So you want scalability at this common knowledge level. That is the challenge. I also meant from a perspective of like uh, like a complexity analysis. So, does it you know when you get more and more people involved, does it need to scale in some kind of way that uh, like it, do you do you like to see certain kind of properties in order to say something is scalable? Oh, absolutely. I took a little bit implicitly that the people transacting are uh, actually very different. Mm. So if there is uh, two people who can do uh, uh, fast transactions per second with each other, this is not so interesting. What we really need is to say there are billions of people and at any point in time, you know, thousands and thousands of them want to transact with, with each other and you want to support that. 